guys, what's up? I am Lingling from Lena Around. I've been here in China for four years where I have both been working as a teacher but also studying Chinese. In today's video, I am going to show you how you can use these public shared bikes here in China. So without further ado, let's just get into it. tell you a little bit more about this new phenomenon. These public shared bikes became super popular last year here in Beijing. I'm in Beijing right now by the way. Because Beijing is so big the distances are so long and also the traffic is extremely heavy here literally all the time unless you're going out in the middle of the night. Riding a bike is just so much easier really. Also when you get off from the subway station you very often have to walk a few kilometers before you actually get to where you're supposed to go. So I would say this is just extremely convenient for everyone. It's not only locals who are using these bikes. Us experts can also go for it because the apps are in English as well. So you don't even have to know Chinese to be able to rent one of these and bike around the city. <laughs> I'm sure that you're super excited to get started on riding your public shared bike here in Beijing. So let's just get into it. First, you need to install the app. You can find the apps in, surprise, the App Store, of course. You can look for Mobike or Ofo. That's like the two main ones here. Please install that first. Also, when you're signing up to using the public shared bikes here, you have to put down a deposit. It's different from each company. With Mobike, I paid 300 RMB and then I'll get them back if I decide to stop using their bikes, which I won't. <laughs> so now let me show you how to use the Mobike. So first you need to find a bike. You can find these public shared bikes almost everywhere around the big cities like Beijing, Shanghai and Guangzhou. But if you can't find a bike, you can open up the app, the Mobike app, where you can see the map of where the nearest bike is. There are usually a lot of bikes around subway entrances and also bus stops. So that was all for this tutorial. I hope that you're ready to ride the shared bikes here in Beijing. Now I'll take my mobile here and uh, bike home. So see you next time. Bye.